Hello everybody and welcome to the 16th C tutorial where we will be looking at linking. Now this is the program from tutorial 16 if you didn't notice. So what we're going to do now is compile it. As you can see I've gone through it before but I'll explain to it in pieces how it works. So we do all of our normal stuff, our name so let's call it test like I did above. And this bit here is important. <coughs> now what you do is you put L. You always need to put an L. And then followed by that, you place the name of the library file if you know it. Because you will need to know it. So as you can see it's called L N cursors. If I can spell cursors right. And then we're gonna place test. Now what I did notice is that the as you can see it's down here rather than like somewhere up here. These segments of the display is a lot bigger than I'm used to because I'm normally doing 80 by 25 since I normally do Windows Console. Whereas here it's clearly bigger. So, yeah. And then you just press enter, which finishes it because that sort of satisfies the get chart. So that's linking in a nutshell. You can link any number of libraries in this way. So if I wanted to, I could link another language, another one, so like L Math or something, I don't know. I'm not sure if it exists, I'm just proving it, yeah. C math, I'm not sure what it's called. Yeah, I didn't think it exist. See, that's the clear bloody error. So, you can link as many as you like, you can have as many files in there as you like, as well, as long as the main file comes first, from what I can tell. So, thank you for watching. This is the 16th C tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did, and I shall see you later.